On April 3, the usual pomp and ceremony to start a new parliamentary year coloured 81 Duke Street in Kingston. Prime Minister Portia Simpson-Miller and Opposition Leader Andrew Holness led their members into Gordon House. The Governor-General, Sir Patrick Allen, customarily delivered the throne speech. This speech outlined the government's priorities for the new 2014-2015 legislative year. The Prime Minister says her government is going for growth. We're working very hard to stay on course to ensure that we can move the country forward. We're going for growth, for development, with job creation. And whatever we do, we are keeping the Jamaican people at the center of what we do. The fact that we have no fiscal space, we have to be very prudent. At the same time, we are working hard to ensure that the poor and the vulnerable are always in front of us and that whatever we do, that they will be protected. The opposition leader says some curious things were mentioned by the Governor General. The proposition that there will be a return to growth in the bauxite sector when we have not had any confirmation from Roussel as to whether or not those plants will be reopened. Again, we hear the regurgitation of promises about early childhood education, school feeding program. These are things that if you were to take the throne and put them together, you would see that they are recurring points which somehow we just never seem to reach a point where we can conclude on these issues. So as far as own speeches go, it is what is to be expected. Um, it's, it, it doesn't give any hope, in my view. Um, what they have programmed in for young people is nothing. 